What's up guys? Welcome back to the Stafford Way channel. Today we're on video number like three for the moment. Um, but we started a fire for Houston. He wanted to help daddy start a fire. And he's uh, drinking my Mountain Dew right now. Getting a good <laughs> drink. Um, but anyways, what I'm going to do at the moment is I'm going to show you my grill that I got from Walmart. Tell you a little bit about it. Then we're going to cook some hot dogs on it. So I'm going to tell you a little bit about it. We're going to use the gas side today. But it does have a pellet side. And I love it. So stay tuned. Break it. Do it. You can't get it, can you, buddy? Get it. Okay, so my grill cover is uh, really dirty, but this is the grill that I got. It's a Charleston, and uh, it's cast iron. So on this side, it's a pellet. It does come with two... Um, temperature testers but I don't even use them because five minutes on both sides of anything really works to get it to your temperature but you can set it to smoke um, at the beginning and that puts out the pellets inside which I got to clean out all this junk let me clean that out real quick so you set it to that on smoke and it's going to throw out pellets into this little part down in there you can't see it really because it's dark but it goes down into a little cup in there uh, it starts cooking and then you can turn up your degree at whatever you want it to be and then it will flame up and then you can either sear it with it open on your steaks or you can shut it and cook it and mine's gotten a little dirty i need to clean on this side but i haven't been using it on this side too often uh, which is my favorite side but i haven't got to use it on this side because i don't have an electric hookup over here it does need electric because it hooks up here for your auger to keep sending your pellets through so anyways, that's that. There's your start button, your prime button, and then on the back, you take this out to unload your pellets to change them. And right now I have in there charcoal. Um, so that's that side. I do gotta go through and do some cleaning on this side, so don't uh, judge me for that. I kinda use that side for storage because it's a, it's a pretty walk to our house. So, and I, I mean, I do have a trash can right there. But anyways, this is what we're gonna be using on today. Um, for this, it's a pit boss grill, by the way, Charleston pit boss. Um, it's got three burner, and then of course we got our gauges on both sides. A little smokestack for this side. You can also smoke in this, so you would turn your pellets on, cook over there, pull this little handle open, and then the smoke would come through, and you can put on this side whatever you want to smoke. So today we're going propane. So I'm gonna turn this on, and we're gonna turn this over. Now, I love this grill because it gets hot super quick. So I can turn it all the way up here. You can see the flames going in there. I'm gonna shut this and I'll literally give it like five minutes, maybe even two minutes, and we'll be around 350, 400. And I throw on everything at about 450, 500. And that cooks everything. Same thing on this side. That thing gets hot super quick. Once you plug it in and turn it on, it's ready to go. So I love this grill. It was about, I believe, five hundred dollars or so um but you get both sides and you can smoke with it so it's a three in one i love it a lot you can change your pellet flavor i've done apple apple hickory and charcoal and i love the charcoal um i've always loved the charcoal flavor so that's pretty much what you get out of that so anyways we got the grill heated up and ready to go um once it does i'll throw on some hot dogs show you how quick that goes and uh show you how good it does so i love it um that's just my little review of the Charleston, the Pit Boss Charleston. I got it at Walmart. Super, super good grill. Um, I would recommend it. Uh, I like it better than just a gas because I love gas, but I like it better than just gas because you get both sides. I've never had a pellet, and I will say I'm a huge fan of pellet. It's really good. The only thing that is the downside of pellet is you have to have electric. You hear them over there fussing. Anyway, so stay tuned and we'll get the hot dogs thrown on the grill in just a minute. All right, so we got our hot dogs on, heat turned up. It takes about three to five minutes on both sides. These hot dogs are going to be just the way we like them um, and ready to go. So there you have it. There is the Charleston Pit Boss Grill. I love it to death. If you're looking for a nice grill, this is for you. Um, it has a little side tray, little hooks for things you can hang up. You can hang your pieces of tools on there. I like that. There you go, you hang them like that. But uh, I just use my side tricks, I don't use it for anything else. And your propane sits there, you can have a little storage on the bottom. But anyways, that's all. So, I 
thanks for watching please hit that like and subscribe button ring that notification bell if you want to look into any further videos of ours and uh we're gonna eat some hot dogs so see you